absolutely beautiful morning here in Sweden today. I've done my Qigong like I do every morning and I'm ready to paint. I am gonna work on this painting today. I have to prepare it. It's a few layers in, maybe two or three layers in. And I've used some acrylic inks and then uh, just put some glitter on top of it so it dry. But the texture makes it very hard to paint on. It will come off. So I need to seal it before I start painting over it. And I have all my paints here and also a few mediums that I can use today for this. gloss which is absolutely fantastic but it's not the look I'm looking for today because I want I don't want it to be that heavy body I also have a self-leveling gel which is amazing but it has to lay flat for quite some time before it's ready to paint over and I don't feel like waiting today I really feel like painting so this is the painting I really want to work on as soon as it dries this is another painting I've been working on. This was inspired by my Qigong practice. You can see this figure doing some Qigong Tai Chi-like movements. It's just a few layers in, so this figure might just as well disappear. I never paint uh, knowing what my painting will look like, not even having a feeling or thought of exactly how it's gonna be or what about it's gonna be. So this is intuitive visionary painting where I just go and paint the feeling that I feel the most, the colors that speak to me a feeling and recently I've had like very vivid dreams for almost two weeks or like almost three weeks actually it is now um, it's like a scene it, it changes the story in the scene changes a little bit but it's a scene from something that looks a bit like Latin America back in the days like a long time ago I think and uh, there are some pyramids there there's jungle uh, the weird thing is that there are also elephants <laughs> which you can't really see in Latin America, so it makes absolutely no sense, obviously. The people there are also much fairer skin than uh, people living there today. So, probably an imagination. Uh, there are also lots of gold uh, there, and, um, some gold plates and like writings, and it's pretty amazing. It's a beautiful dream, it gives me an absolutely overwhelming feeling of happiness. And that's what I would like to convey in my paintings. I'm not sure it if it will come forward in this painting, this painting, or any painting soon, but that's, that's a feeling that I have had for quite a few days now, and this dream keeps coming back, and that's not common for me. I usually have a vivid dream. I write it down in my dream journal, uh, sometimes analyze it, sometimes with the help of a Jungian analyst, sometimes by myself. But this is different. This is the same scene for like, so many days. So see where it brings my painting process because that's what I feel in this room. You have to paint this, you have to paint this feeling. So that's what I'm gonna do. So stay in touch, look at my stuff and maybe you'll see the paintings that come out of this. Bye!